Hi! <laughs> I'm the worst. Hi. I'm I'm also Viv. I, I am Viv, comma, the worst. That's my that's my uh that that that's my sick ass armored core name. Hi. So you might be wondering, Viv, why are you so late? And the answer is I am suffering the effects of having symptoms disorder. I apologize. Today's been wild. I had an interview. I, I, I went on a pilgrimage to 7-Eleven and Dollar General, which are in, like, opposite directions of my house. I've had a long day. I've had a long day. Oh, and I have my bot on. Awesome. I am so out of it. I think I know why, but we'll talk about that as I stream. Let's play some Armored Core before I get more distracted. Oh, give me one other second, I have to jump to my Discord. Oh. One of these days, one of these days, I'll be, like, a lot better at this whole streaming thing. It's been like, what, four years since I've really got my nose to grindstone? Here's hoping 2024 is my year, baby. Five whole years. Whoa. Anyway. Ugh. So I'm going to be blunt. I'm going to give it 100%. I may or may not, may or may not have consumed a, consumed a weed gummy before starting this stream. May or may not. I will not specify. I will not name names. I will not kiss and tell. You have to do the legwork yourself, chat. <laughs> and that might be why I started so late. Because I was, I, I was just screwing around on my phone. And then I look up, and it's 5.29. And I'm like... Shit. <laughs> I'm so late. I'm the latest that's ever been. Give me a minute, chat. Let me just capture it again. <laughs> oh, God. One of these days, I'm gonna be sick, nasty, and you, then you'll see. Then you'll all see. One second, let me. Yeah, you know, that's fine. Let me drag down my dumbass PNG tuber. Yeah, there we go. We're all gravy now. Everything's fine. Everything's sick. Could not be literally any better if I wanted it to, except for my hat being off center. It will just make it bigger. Yes! Anyway. <laughs> I actually take this up so I can see the damn video game. Perfect. Alright. It's been a minute, but we're back. Finally, with Armor Core 6. I took a quick detour to play dumb videos game. Paper Mario specifically. It's a dumb video game I like. But uh, we got we got more we got more stuff to do. We have more places to kill oh we're just way back at the beginning huh all right we've seen all this shit already i'm just gonna skip it we got no time to wait we have guys to kill i'm gonna try to make all the choices i didn't make last time but i don't know if i'll remember let's get it popping let's get it going let's get it gravy i want water Eight years away from my desk. Main system activating combat mode. Commence mission. Check out the Dafang MT squad. So yeah, um, I, I've had an interesting day. Like I said, I got my, I got a, I finally got an interview. Uh, weirdest interview I've ever done, and I was potentially under the influence and just, you know, a little. I was a little bit um, just worried about the whole thing and how it would go, but it went well. I think I, I stuttered a couple of times. I'm hoping I still get the the job despite the kind of whack interview. But hey, anything's possible, right? See you later, nerd.
I was enjoying the relief of like not having. I'm finally getting a damn interview that I've I've lost sight of everything else. I don't think anybody really comes to the stream for my punctuality. It comes for my like winning personality. I think. Exhausting day. I went out earlier to go get some heavy cream for a dish I was making. It was carbonara, by the way. Now let's begin because we ran out, but you know, close enough. I got a half and half, and it came out really good, actually. It came out super good. I gotta have more of it after the stream. No new messages. What are they screaming at me for? Uh oh, hold on, chat. Uh, I have to plug in my laptop. There we go. Sick. Damn it, it didn't plug all the way in. Are you serious right now, dude? Come on. There we go. Ugh. Alright. I'm just looking through here. This game loves to yell at me. Hey, there's new pots in. You gotta get your new pots in. Captain, what's this one? This is this kind of a fan funnel, yeah. Oh, sick. That one's pretty good. <sighs> Excuse me. Ah! Can't even do the arena anymore. I'm literally done it all. I wanted more chips for my OS tuning, but I have like three left, so. What could I drop it on? Weight control. Oh, I see. Quick turn, manual aiming, assault armor. Uh, it's maybe kind of short. I'm a little. Oh! What's up, Jazz Crew? Hi, we're, we're back with Armored Core 6. I took a quick break from it, but we're back. Hi. What's poppin'? Hell yeah. I think I saw you playing Mahjong. I need to get back into playing it. Once I'm a little bit more settled in, probably when I'm moving and everything, I will also probably be back playing Mahjong. I have to fix a lot of shit. More money. But I'm getting a... I, I did get an interview for once, so I might be getting a new job. We will see. We will see. It will supplement this, and it'll have to just do it basically all day, so... But hey, it's a job. I hope it only lasts until like 4.30, like the training. But that's to go longer goes longer, right? And not to be like later streams, but we'll, we'll, we'll figure something out. Either way, I'm like 18 levels of relieved right now. Y'all have no idea. I am... In such relief. Yeah, I'm hoping it is too. I mean, this is my job also, but you, you know what I mean, I hope, Chet. Enjoy armored core. Keep up the good work. I love being in my war crime mech, doing all kinds of sick war crimes. It is the coolest.
truth is, I'm taking like zero damage compared to the start of the game, but that's mostly because I'm, you know, at the latter half of the game. Or the latter retread of the game, anyway. Oh god! You're sniping me! realize how kind of out of it I am. I feel so spacey. Meh. Um. <laughs> uh. It's been a while since I played this game again, but I it, it's it's very hard to forget just the feeling of this video game. It's so much fun. No new messages. I'm also just consuming junk that I bought when I went out. I'm trying to tell myself not to. Just get the only thing that you need, but... I, the, 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 the siren song of temptation hits me every time I go in looking for shit at, like, Dollar General. I'm like, mmm, candy. So I'm skipping all the lore. Like, um, like I said, I've already done this in an earlier run-through. It should be up on YouTube by now. So, you can watch my first run-through there. I'm not sure when the game starts changing, but I'm sure we'll find out. <clears throat> I tried to get some work done on the, um, so I wanted to do a 3D model and I wanted to finish it my first donut today, uh, by yesterday, and I, it got delayed till today. Symptom Disorder is real. I've gotten almost done with it, I just need to, like, actually put on the coloring, I think. What's up, Julian? How's a uh, common rider? Got him. Get smoked. Enemy AC destroyed. Pog. It's good to hear. I'm a little bit tired. I'm, I'm I'm running on like exhilaration and like anxiety fumes a little bit, but I actually got an interview, so I'm I'm riding high on that. Mm. Oh, actual new message. Ray, what's my message from? Six two one. About the test. Oh. AC. This one. That was being shipped to Balaam's main force. Oh, it's this is new. No amateurs. New dialogue. Remember who you're messing with. Okay. Okay, so this this is new dialogue. Sorry about that. I have to probably relax. Um. Yeah, that sounds about right. Kabuto would be that kind of character we have on virtual shit. I love that fusion states as a character. I love that design. Target for this mission is a squad of transport choppers. Destroy them. You'll encounter guerrilla resistance from Faust mass produced entities. They're no great concern. I remember seeing that. You performed adequately in your last sortie, Raven. This did not go unnoticed. We will be watching with interest to see what you bring to the team. Oh. 
I guess it's talking about me blowing up their mech before this. That's an interesting change in dialogue. I think it is. I don't remember. I think I was, like I said, I think I was playing that. I'd probably play like Cougar or Agito. I love Agito. I should watch, I should finish Agito. It's one of the ones I haven't finished, but I've started. I got close. That's gross. Guilty Gear should let you do that. Big boy over here. Except for, I guess, Nigo, who's like bottom tier apparently. Poor guy. As if my manager much doesn't get enough disrespect. Thank you, Walter. Nigo is included in that? Okay, good. Alright. Let me, uh... I'm gonna change my design a little bit. I'm gonna use the, uh, stuff I won from the final boss. After this cutscene, I'm in. <laughs> yeah. This is new. Uh, Handler Walter, forgot to mention something. Hmm? The Liberation Front's changing the strategy, but cozying up to independent mercs. Great news, if it means more work for 621. Yeah, what do you mean They can it? try whatever tricks they want. The Red Guns are ready to smash some heads. Hmm. Yeah, this is new dialogue. Cool. As expected from, uh, what's his name? Big Man. I see your back, 621. The Corps see the Liberation Front as a hindrance to expanding their Coral Survey. But to the Rubiconians, your actions are only helping the Corps with their invasion. It's just a job, 621. All of it. Damn. You sure sound dour. Always chipper in the morning. Mr. Walter. All right, let me let me try out some new shit. You know what I mean? Let me try out some new stuff. Yeah, boy. Oh wait, that's the wrong way. Oh, that's the that's the other one. Overburden. I guess I need better legs.
Customers have equipped already. Please, okay. What's up? That's me? At least as far as uh, people need to know. What's up? I'm excited. I'm getting the all caps name in backward. You can RC in a normal into a super and it costs less than doing a raw super? That's hilarious. Literally stonks. Literally stonks. Let's go. That's hype. That's so goaded. No, Sailor Moon S is way grotier. Like, by a country mile. Got a job for you, 621. You're joining an operation planned by Balaam HQ. Check the briefing. So there's any dialogue here. Heard the good news from Walter, did ya? Good. Sit your ass down and listen. <laughs> Balaam's moving in on the Gallia Dam complex, one of the Liberation Front's bases. The objective is to destroy their lifeline and make those sacks of shit beg for mercy. I'll be sending two good-for-nothing maggots from the Red Guns, Gun 4 Volta and Gun 5 Iguasu. Um, you know. going to be tagging along on ass-wiping duty. I'm assigning you the call sign Gun 13, a lucky little number that just... I think this is new dialogue. Gun 13, sound off! I like the good enough. That's fun. That's really fun. You will play anything competitively. You know? People will play like the funniest, most busted ass dreck you can imagine. I'll stick with six two one. Don't let the red guns teach you bad manners. Get his ass. Two targets destroyed. How about that? Yes, you're not a total amateur. And these guys kind of suck. Can't say I considered you a pro either. Woo! Get his ass. Sounds like kind of fun. Interesting. Your call, six two one. Your cooperation is appreciated, Raven. Six two one. We've received a friendly ID tag from the Liberation Front. Let's not waste their firepower. Remaining. 
I'm getting cooked. Yeah, I'm not doing any damage to this fucker. Never mind. made his way over here. Just saved it. Beg to differ. I'm gonna die. Hundred percent. Left shoulder ammunition at fifty percent. It's the last hole. Got him. My hands are starting to cramp a little bit. Got him. Well, time to see where this leaves us. I really liked either of these jackasses anyway, so. I uh, don't exactly care. <laughs> so let's see where this leaves us in the story. One new message. Oh, am I gonna get hate mail? We're getting a scrub quote live from Xbox Live Arcade. Let's go. Hell yeah. You got lucky, Merc. Yeah, 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 yeah. So you got a nice punch in. Go buy a lottery ticket. Red guns are going to be first over the wall. Give me that. Fun watching from the sideline. Give me that sick ass Marvel player got bopped and getting complained to me like via voice call at Xbox Live. Let's go, baby. Vintage, classic, even. All right. I mean, let me go back to my usual loadout. Yeah, I don't know if that's him or that's Robbie Damon. Either one, I think. It's really the best, like, overall? Like, yeah, this ain't bad all around. I'll take that. I'll keep it. What about legs? These are just kind of better. But these are just... Also way better. You see how this kind of feels when I move it around? Ugh. I realize how kind of tired I am. What well, feels smooth, though. Yeah, this is fine, I think. I'll be a little chunky, but... 
Let me actually just check one thing, though. Hmm. Ideal weight, seven, 672, 77200. Yeah, I'm a little bit overweight. Um, pfft, shit. All right, I won't use these legs. Let me try other legs that are just as good, if not better. Where's the mind alpha? All right, yeah, I'll go with this. I don't really have much of a choice but to do this, but at least I made a lot of money off of it. Got a job for you, six two one. Let me check real quick while this is cutting this playing out. Request from the archivist group. Raven, this request comes from Schneider, an archivist subsidiary. Is that snail. The mission will take place in the Bonadea dunes of Western Bellius. Our coral investigation there is being blocked by the Strider, a Rubicon Liberation Front mining ship. You are to destroy it. Got one Michigan is DC Strider Douglas? Is you know what that makes sense. Space that was extensively weaponized by the Liberation Front. Call it the crowning glory of their efforts to militarize into an anti-corporate force. Your attack will focus on the eye, a giant laser cannon connected directly to the main generator. It's protected by a shield, which is powered by auxiliary subgenerators. These should be your first targets. This concludes the briefing. Good luck. Gunfiber Guazu is Griffin Burns, who is in a bunch of goofy animes. Voice actor in, um, what's it called? Looks like. Oh, he's Dapio. That's fun. Yokai Watch. It is Mr. Yokai Watch, huh? Anyways. We're focusing now. Time for a little self promotion, 621. Marginally speaking. I would like more self promotion. <laughs> Wish I knew how to do it better. But, you know, I'll have to learn. Uh. Yeah, this might not be too terribly long a stream. I'm, I, I, <laughs> I mean, I think I'm kind of sleepy, I am. I was up, like, pretty early today. Not by choice, I think I just had a nightmare or something. JYB voices in this. Oh, I heard his voice in here before. Oh my god. Alright, now you're up close and personal. Take out one of its legs and bring it to a halt. Oh, I wonder how big this thing must be. Like, this must be the size of, like, at least an entire city in and of itself.
Still, like, if, 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 a Jesus. Yeah, like, the idea of scale on this and how powerful these mechs are, uh, really puts into perspective just, like, I feel how powerful they are. Because, like, if they're trying to take down, like, a, something this big, it, it must be pretty tough. Got my eyebrow itches, like, right now. Ugh. Probably disgustingly. But there is like there there are some mechs in here that are like I wouldn't say they're like planet destroyers, but they're at least able to level like probably a, a solid country or two without even like really going through most of their reserves, I bet. There's one further down. Ugh. All right. All sub generators destroyed. The ice shield is offline. Head to the front segment and hit the target. I like the power scaling in this is probably a lot more like consistent than something like say Dragon Ball. Dragon Ball's power scaling makes no sense. It's just, you are a Saiyan or you are not, and there are sometimes, like, a little bit of leeway you get, but not much. Oh, it's behind me! Hello, Captain! Ah! At least it's not like Conrad or Ender is writing in to begin with the word Zio is immediately disqualified from the top tier. No! But like, Decade is also dumb strong. Decade, Kuga, like Kuga gets like a bunch of dumb forms that are like, probably country leveling. I'd imagine. Probably planet cracking also. Like, look up, say, I, I think the only writer form to beat how stupid, um, what, the, like, Kuga's ultimate form, I think, was like, um, what is it, Hyper Muteki was the first? Yeah, something like that. Besides, like, base CO is just stupid. I'm not really that strong in this Oma form, which is, like, debatably canon. You know, debatably. In the same way that, like, a bunch of doofy Superman forms are debatably canon. Be the handler, I presume, for the independent mercenary uh, this schmuck. Honor to make your acquaintance. I understand you want to join Operation Wall Climber. You do realize that disposing of some Liberation Front garbage hardly qualifies you. Know your place, you meager dog sitter. The answer is no. I hear you're deploying V1 again. Must be rough only having one good plan. Oh! 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 Are you suggesting oh! you can take Freud's place? Get his ass. 
we'll see. Just give us the chance. Very well, then. We're also deploying V4. Who's been equally brazen of late? Let's see how they both perform. You know, I'm gonna go down this path that's just straight Rubicon all the way through. I'm curious to see how it changes the game. What kind of lore bits we get. Because I'm actually interested in just this pathway. I know it's not like that big of a diversion, but I'm just curious, you know? Raven, your work on the Strider deserves commendation. I am thrilled to have issued you the request. No, I'm 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 six five. I am the Archivist Group's mercenary liaison. Oh, hi, Pater. I think I'll enjoy doing business with you. I super killed you with another Tide Blade, bro. And I probably will again. That's beside the point. I wonder what this boss is. Uh, so while we're back at the Jumbo Gym, I'm probably going to change things up a bit just for funsies. Um, the theme will be fighting games. This is V2 Snare, leader of the Vesper Second Squad. I will chair the briefing for this mission. This is an operation of my own design. Consider it a privilege to be called to participate. Ugh. You will be attacking the Wall, a key trading outpost fortified by the Rubicon Liberation Front. The rabble have formed a defensive line comprised of artillery and MT squads. Break through the line, then make your way to the top of the wall. There you shall find the Juggernaut, a mobile heavy artillery platform. Destroy it. Oh, that thing, yeah. V4 will also oh, Johnny Young Bosch is woo-woo-hi. Woo and aware Swinburne. And has also taken a crack at the wall. Only for their vainglorious hopes to be dashed. Do try not to die like a dog out there. Your objective is to take the Liberation Front Fortress. I think I've done this find already, if I remember correctly. I don't remember though. No, I've definitely done this before. This is all retread. This is all new game plus. So, who's to say, truly? Uh, this will probably go up, like, after I'm done streaming. Um... Main system. Activating combat mode. Uh, I wish I didn't start so late. I already feel spacey right now. We'll start by clearing the way for Archibus. Take out the Gatling cannons protecting the city, and the bow steps upon MT further in. There's heavy fire coming from up top. 621. Hey, can I stop getting shot, please? That'd be really special. That'd be really swell. I go that way. I want to see, uh, isn't there like a secret hidden fight like around here? I want to try fighting it. Probably die. It's down here, yeah? Something like that.
If I can't find nothing, I'll just head back. For the time being, I wish to know. Nope, there's something around here. Alright, move on. Oh, there's definitely a secret fight somewhere around here, but I don't remember where. I think it might be after I think it might be like before you close the door. Like chests in here either. If I can't find it, I'll go looking for it later. Let's just move on. How's that sound, Chet? So I just gonna end up being just a regular two-hour stream. I'm, 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 I'm a little tired. At the fight Balteus too. I'm gonna be exhausted. We're inside the wall. Be prepared for close quarters combat. I can already feel it, chat. No. Do you read me? This is V4 Rusty. You're fast. Guess you're sharper than they say. I'll have to step up my own game. At some point, I want to play some like I don't want to play light gun games. But I also don't because it's they're light gun games. They're gonna be murder on the eyes. So if I'm just gonna be playing some super scope games, I want to play Yoshi Safari and um, Battle Clash at some point. I like I love Battle Clash. In case you don't know, and uh, why would you? Battle Clash is a duology of light gun games made for the. Super. Oh no, did I miss my chance to get more ammo? Uh, they're for the Super Nintendo, for the Super Scope specifically. They're actually pretty cool. You're playing as a mech pilot, or well, a mech gunner, with uh, someone else controlling the legs of your mech, the actual movement, where you're the gunner. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Yes, cool. Oh. Supply, Sherpa. Make sure you resupply. Let's, let's cook this guy. What's up, Rusty? You must be Raven. What up? One of the infamous handler Walter sounds. Mm hmm Do it to it. That's the juggernaut. Heavy mobile kit. I wouldn't recommend taking it head on. It won't be able to keep up with steel haze. I'll distract it while you hit its blind spot. Watch out. It's coming.
Got him. I think I'm definitely taking on Balteus tonight if I can make it there. I was gonna do chapter one today, and I'll do chapter two and shit uh, tomorrow. Confirmed. Juggernaut destroyed. Operation Wall Climber is a success. That pilot, Rusty, it seems he knew who you really are. It won't matter. I've taken that contingency into account. Oh, that's a new dialogue. I think. I, I, I hate forgetting what's new and what's old dialogue, but I feel like this is new dialogue. Just see where, where this lore takes us. Whoa. One new message. Yep. We're war buddies now. I think I should tell you something. Mm -hmm. During Operation Wall Climber, Archibus was planning to sacrifice you. Well, that's easy. Plan to use independent mercenaries to clear the way so that the Vespers could step in and take over. But instead, you took the wall. Mm -hmm. Both the higher-ups and the Rubiconians are going to remember the name Raven now. As will I. Later, Rusty. You're cool. I hope to work with you more again soon. Mission to rescue... That's a new one, I think. Got a job for you, 621. The client is the Rubicon Liberation Front. Here's the briefing. The loss of the so what's up, chat? A heavy blow. How's it going? Yet, we believe you are more than a corporate pawn. Perhaps we can even work together. I want you to investigate Baus Arsenal Number no. 2, a major MT factory in the Bellius region. The Baus Corporation sells to anyone, but they've been essential to maintaining our firepower. Now, their second arsenal has gone silent overnight. Mm hmm If it were only a comms failure, a simple check-in would do. But, well, after the Strider... More cautious voices have gained influence. Understandable. This is our finest moment, but would appreciate your help. Fair enough. You got it, Captain. Some advice before you go, six two one. Expect the unexpected. Like, it was barely even like I think a quarter of a gummy, but it's it's kicking my ass. I am so tired. Commence mission. Investigate Baus Arsenal number two. I've been checking the perimeter, and I'm picking up nothing. What happened here? It's too quiet. Looks like the, uh, the what's it called? How'd you get all the way over there? Continue 
I'm still unsure what I want to do with the Patreon. I'm still, like, talking about it. I apologize. I'm just... I really want to make it worth something for people to, like, pledge to. Think that Walter. That feels like a very big leap of logic. Yep. Well, he's right. How the hell? That's annoying. All clear. Keep going, six two one. Are they not just not like visible until I'm at a certain spot? Oh, this is going about in your opinion. Um, it simply depends on how you decide to play the game. At the end of the day, you are not exactly a hero, but you can at the very least make choices that defy what the corporations want or what the Rubicon Liberation Front wants. And I enjoy the fact there are like multiple ways to play the game. And I appreciate that like. At the end of the day, the R the RLF is just right all the way through. I appreciate that a lot. Another dealt with. Uh, the narrative is a lot about like just free will, choosing your own path, choosing your own like destiny and shit like that. Because a lot of that, a lot of the game is deciding. You know what? It sucks, and I don't want to have to choose between literally killing an entire sentient like form of life or you know 
guilt a bunch of corporations. Or Dave. Yeah, it is, it is a lot of that. Like, the corpse are definitely a force of bad. Like, unquestionably so. The way that they toy with lives, the way that people associated with them are, like, huge elitists, xenophobes, etc. Like, with Snail. Like, it's a lot about free will, I feel like. Because you, you have the ability to choose. Like, I had a choice early in this stream where I had to choose between, like, agreeing to work with the RLF or just not, and it involved, like, killing dudes I was working with, and I, I, I jumped at the chance. Fuck them. There's choices. Choices in this game matter. I feel like, um... The choices you make matter, and you do get to make a funny robot. A funny war crime mech, yes. But the choices you do, you make, do matter. Mm -hmm. About the coral well that was found in Bows Arsenal Number Two. That was just a drip coming from an underground vein, and it won't last long. Mm -hmm. It's not the coral we're searching for. Ah, uh, I guess I'm learning more about Walter and stuff through this. Uh, the way this the uh, retread has brought me. Oh, uh, but here's a new mission, I think. Another RLF mission. I guess it's because I killed, um... Well, not killed, but I beat Iguazu and, uh, the other guy. The Rubiconians, the RLF, this faction that I'm working with right now, are the good guys equivocally. Like, there's no gray area, there's no what we're doing is, like, seen as wrong. They are simply correct to want to do the things they're trying to do. You got it, boss. Oh, hello. Yo, back off. Hands up the merchandise, buster.
What's up? Oh god. Mother where'd you go? Back off, idiot. Nice, nice. Isn't going great. Aw, oh, damn it. Never mind. Let's try again. So I was too far away. All right, let's let's fix that, shall we? System activating combat mode. Glad to hear. You, glad to see you here, Ire. Hope having a good day. Oh, the glasses are nice, by the way. Sure, bro. What else is up, chat? How we feeling? How are we feeling? How are we doing? off, idiot. Okay, so that's just we were too late. guaranteed to happen every time.
I got it, I got it, I got it. There we go. I wish Elf when I would run to the game zone that said every time we made a new section we made in TVC. Yeah, I understand that. Um Don't click in! Like other guys showing up yet? Did I get them all? Really? I'm goaded. I'm cracked. I'm sick. A chew. There's Nile. There's Nile. I can't believe I did that, like, second try. Mm. That was a mess. Uh, at least it wasn't that bad. That was a pretty... That was a pretty quick and easy escort mission, all things considered. I've done with... I've done with way worse. money. So at about like maybe 7.30, 8 o'clock, I'll take a break. I'm a little tired. Looking good for a change. I see you've got a new augmented human. What happened to 617 and the rest? Their jobs. They did what it took to get us here. Hmm. Huh. So how's the newcomer doing? Adequately. But Gen 4 augmentation can be unstable. We need to choose our battles. How's things on your end? I found the data our friends left behind. There's something promising in the watch point.
two new messages. Let me thank you again, Raven. We couldn't have rescued our comrades without your help. Father Dolmayan is a key figure to the movement. A great coral warrior who witnessed the fires of Ibis and a guide to us all. Mm -hmm. But now it seems like he's... No, I shouldn't. He carries a heavier burden than any of us. It's the same burden, shouldn't it be? A personal note before you go. Thanks for saving. Oh, this one, yeah. Alright, we'll do this one. It'll probably take me like another decade of attempts and then I'll chill out with the stream for right now. Personal request from a friend of mine. It concerns a certain facility. Or I'll start a little bit of chapter two. Once I think. Just for fun use. Now it serves to monitor the door. I just wanna get the full context for like for this where the RLF ending again. I know it's not the most interesting, but I I, I like the RLF a lot. more context to some of the other characters in the game too. You'll be going in under cover of darkness. Be ready for uh, tomorrow will be the jumble gym. I'm gonna try to start playing some newer games soon. I would love to play more new games, but uh, poor. I uh, when this job pans out, so I can start buying new games to stream and whatnot. Um, here's hoping. You know, here's hoping. Uh, if I can get that, then a lot of bigger problems should mostly go by the wayside. Um, I won't have the goal anymore, I don't think, unless I need to start saving up for something, like a new GPU. Which might be at next stream's big self-fundraiser. But uh, we'll, we'll, we'll talk about that later. We'll talk about that later. For the time being, um, new job potential. I'm excited. No evidence. If anyone sees you, handle it. Next time I'll start on time. Sorry about the uh, weird delay. From air, I want to get more lore about like, literally everything. What happened to the patrol squad? Code one egg. All units deploy for combat. Exposed to snipers from all quarters. Keep moving, or they'll shoot you down. Code three one seat. We've taken critical damage. Whoop. I'm excited to fight what's his name? Big man in a second. This is gonna be a fun boss. You see that? Now that I'm a uh, higher level and everything, a lot stronger. A lot better at this video game, and I'm not I am probably gonna be playing like friggin' Toho against this boss, but I'm excited anyway. Let's get it. Attack. 
attacking a watch point. You're Hi, Robbie Damon. Handler, Walter. Hi, Happy Chaos. How many of your dogs must I kill before you learn? I got more lore about this asshole. Other uh, than when I get in the Coliseum. Um, oh, hold on. Not yet, dude. Don't cheat. I'm, I'm trying to get gummy bears out of my bag. Oh, I know. I know. We're about to start. Boss being like near, but it's not that bad by comparison. I literally have like a, a whole ass different area in my mind of fighting that boss. I'm probably just gonna confuse with Belteus. Literally fighting a shmup boss. Playing Gradius. This motherfucker. I didn't blow it up completely. I was trying to see if I could get away. Nope. Good job, Locks you in. You gotta get air in your head. We're done here. Air in your Back lungs. What do they know about augmented humans? Also, like, do they are they injected other people? Do they? Made contact. Know what that's like? Eh, weird. I guess the one of those things just never explained. I am Air, a Rubiconian. Please, you must wake up before your consciousness is forever scattered in the coral flow. All right. Fuck it, we Baltes. Augmented human six four six two one. Vital signs confirmed. Disabling autopilot. Establishing comms link with handle. Raven. I've identified an approaching enemy. It's Baltes time. See how long it takes me this time that I'm powered up. Contact 
I love this boss theme, by the way. It's so good. No, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. I heal more and I do more damage. It'll be fine. After that last Voltaeus fight, like I'm uh I'm kinda cracked at this fight now. I'm not gonna even gonna front. I will I was gonna say I don't think I need to heal, but I'm gonna heal just in case because I I I'm bitch. Is that a big first try? That's a big first try, baby. Let's go. Get this mug out of my face. Blows up. Die. Enemy systems down. It's silent. <laughs> Compared to that, like, last Baltius fight, that was a cakewalk. And thank God, ugh, hated that fight. Hate snail. Rest. But first, a warning. The coral surge you were swept up in. That was just a glimpse. Premonition of the storm of flame that will burn Rubicon. God, I'm so rich. A friend of mine sent me this observational data. Look, six two one. A localized core. Oh, this is new, I think. It's headed straight for the central ice field across the Alien Ocean. I think. I don't remember. Like a flock of birds or a school of fish, Coral loves company. Which means somewhere in the ice field, there's a huge mass of coral lying dormant. This is new. No, this isn't new. This isn't new. Like this is just coming enough for that to just happen. The coral explosion completely vaporized. 
neutralized northwestern Belius is Bay Area. Jesus. How do we survive that? And even yet, compared to the fires of Ibis, that explosion was hardly a spark. It's like an Akira explosion. I have a favor to ask. Yeah? Let me remain in contact with you until we reach the Coral Convergence. Alright. Uh, sounds good. I have to see where they're taking us. How this struggle over the Coral ends. I'm gonna make sure you and your people aren't killed again, because I'm curious to see how that changed. How the story, as it's changed so far, will be influenced by... Well, sorry, I've so far has been influenced by why I've changed it. The choices I've made. Augmented human, C4621. Entering standard, standard mode. mode. Two new messages. I love standard mode. 621. I've got some business to attend to. I need to hog some intel to the corpse and secure a backer for our trip to the ice field. One job for you while I'm out. Rest up. That's an order. Raven. I see your handler is away on business for now. About that trip to the ice field, we've received a job from Balaam already. Let's take a look, shall we? Registration number RB23. Call sign, Raven. You have proven yourself to be truly exceptional, which brings us to a request. The integration program. This program concerns Mind Alpha, a pilotless AC that we have developed, sampling the various factions' machines to assimilate their technology and design philosophies. We would like you to engage it in arena combat to evaluate the accuracy of our model. Okay. Please assist us with the future of all my technology. This sounds like a bad idea. Analysis categorizing the arena. Let's see what that's about. Oh, cool. Oh, and they give you chips? They give you a lot. These must be tough. Let's see what this is all about. Integration program initiating phase one. By engaging the Mind Alpha model in virtual combat. <coughs> Excuse me. Main system activating combat mode. Thing is so fast. Got him. Let's go. Target destroyed. Concluding analysis. Well done. Hmm. This is actually really cool. I like this addition. Gives me more uh, things to upgrade my mech with, and to get money out of it. Hmm. And they give you emblems. Interesting. I don't know who would ever, like, slap a corporation on them. Probably some libertarian schmuck. Lol. But, Jesus. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll put explosive damage on... Or maybe this one. Maybe the next one I get. Anyway, let's go back. Let's go back. Let's see what it said. Uh, as part of its... It starts as a mercenary support initiative. All mine has conducted its own research in the valid of AC parts. Fixed concerns the extensions of human sensory capabilities. 
process of continuous improvement, all men will create an AC that to the pilot has like an extension of their own body. And this one is... Okay, many mercenaries have benefited from the trainer's guidance and stuff they flown from the nest. All mind monitors the progress of trainees in order to further improve the program. Okay. <laughs> Let me just do this really quick. And it's probably gonna be like a little bit extra time because I wanna end probably around like 7 30, 8 o'clock. So I'll probably do a little bit more of the game. The next sample is the trainer AC. This will be integrated into Mind Alpha. Analysis. I get how much this stupid head reminds me of Iron Blooded Orphans. Ugh. Heaven forbid. Main system activating combat mode. Still got hit by that? Whack. I feel like K Brad. Got him. Sorry, I was. I'm thinking about K Brad because I was watching I'm gonna block this whack ass mix up, and it's the funniest video I think I've ever seen. I love I'm gonna block this whack ass mix up. So good. Anyway, uh, pay no attention to me being in the void. I'm, I'm, I have requested to get a new overlay, so hopefully it'll come out, come pretty soon. Whenever uh, the person I've asked to do it gets out of doing it, whenever that's gonna be. I'm not rushing them. Let's see, interface program, final analysis. For that who are not augmented humans, it can be extremely difficult to reassemble an entire AC and immediately adapt to it. All mind traders create a, try to create a future where all mercenaries can enjoy a near symbiotic relationship with their ACs. That is a scary sentiment. That's 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 Elon Musk talk. Gross. Ugh. Integration program phase one. Final analysis. I love how chunky this thing is. The tester AC. This will be integrated into Mind Alpha. Commencing analysis. Main system activating combat mode. It looks like I'm moving to Georgia, probably. I'm not entirely sure yet. But uh, the house we're looking at looks really nice. It looks big compared to this one. I'm gonna live in a decent sized. Well, I guess any house is really a decent size, depending on the amount of people living in it. But um, the house looks nice. It's it's a pretty big looking place. I haven't seen like individual rooms, I don't think, but it looks nice. I hope we get it. I, um, uh, I can only hope that, like, uh, Incoming call. this job I get, uh, remotely will allow at least a little bit of reprieve while I wait for internet to get in the new house Thank whenever I move, for and for the move also. Your testing has identified several key points for improvement to Mind Alpha. The evolution of all mind will not disappoint. 
this automated voice is so sinister. <sighs> Anyways, um, I have so much stuff now, bro. Let's go. Um, weight control, auto aiming, attack controls, or core expansion, by the way. Uh, assault armor, pulse armor, pulse protection. I should probably up explosive damage, but I want to get, uh, actually, let me get this. For speed. I need explosive damage when I get to, uh, the boss again. The, uh, the, the Quebly, I'm going to keep calling it. Just go until the 8 o'clock. They want you to carry out an advanced survey of the central ice field. To confirm the information Walter brought to them about the coral convergence. I think we're not- I, I'm not afraid we've seen the squares on Dream like that before. I have to look at the VODs again. I remember I was just shooting the shit, so I wouldn't remember. ...installed on the upper level of grid 086. You could use it to launch your AC to the ice field. Maybe we've seen this one already. Nothing really new here. Let me handle getting us into the grid. I'm fairly adept at analyzing systems and manipulating them too. <laughs> I love how proud she sounds about that. Good for her. You know? When you're a disembodied sentient entity, you have to have some kind of hobby, I suppose. <laughs> That's probably something just all Rubiconians can do. Commencing infiltration to grid 086. Creating backdoor into system. Deactivating lock on vertical catapult. Connecting steam cylinders. Launching. Got a G Force on that must be insane. Like, you must be getting crunched in there. Let's get to work, shall we? Main system, activating combat mode. I sent you the marker data. Let's head toward the elevator going to the upper level. Uh, the rockets do splash damage, gross. But also cool and makes sense. What the fight, Rummy here? Hi, Rummy. Here. I think I got what's ever over here before already, didn't I? Damn it! That B 
eating me from all the way over here? I swear, some of those shots feel like they're like auto tracking, but I might just suck at the video game. Or, you know, por que no los dos? As they say in Mexico only, because I don't recognize Spain. I'm in Spain without the Spain. I have no idea why that was so funny to me, but just I'm in Spain without the Spain is cracking me up. <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> so dumb. True. I think I'm in Spain without the Spain is quote bot worthy. What do you think? I mean, I'm the one calling the shots, but I'm curious. I don't want to put in dumb shit that's like only half funny. Like, if I did, we would have no room for actual good quotes. <laughs> That's the lead 90% of the shit I say. <laughs> anyway. Uh, am I going backwards or forwards? I'm going forwards, I think. Directing direct in the flow of comedy. Hey, listen. I, 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 as, as someone who is a professional funny person, I think I decide who, who laughs and who cries. Who laughs and who dies. Mostly I die and I laugh and you laugh too. Because I suck, but, you know, don't worry about that. Don't need to worry about that. Yeah, it's Super Fighting Robots Megas, man. Hi, hi, Bun. What's up? I'm doing my round two. Game good. Ah! I like the little changes I've seen so far to the story. Nice. This is your D&D &D day. Or your, not your D&D, &D, tabletop, ugh, D&D, Pathfinder, and D&D, two separate things, and I know that, however, sometimes I'm uncultured. I'm also, well I had that gummy like, hours ago. Yeah, doesn't try to copyright your imagination and shit, like, what, what, like Wizards of the Coast, yeah. That's enough. Major point. Nice surrender. I, I love how full of shit she sounds. I love Carla so much. I love, I, I, I love, I love Carla so much. I, I love I love women's wrongs so much. You're not afraid of anything, are you? I like that in I 
really hate the smart cleaner. I don't think this, the smart cleaner is that hard of a boss. However, its damage output annoys the hell out of me. at some point I can like pay for literally everything I do with like my stream and my small minor stuff that'd be nice ah! but I'm not at that level yet it's not a dig it's just the truth die okay good for a second, I thought I died. But nah, first try. This boss is so annoying. My mech is so wide now with the shoulder mounted crap, like, Jesus. Anyways. <clears throat> I'm literally swimming in so much dosh. Swimming in my credit bin like I'm Scrooge McDuck. Let's go. Alright. Hey, tourist. It's me. I had to work some of my magic to track you down. Probably didn't have to go through all that trouble. For you. Take a look. <laughs> like, I, I feel like Carla, like, knows. Like, you have to go through all that, all that trouble for all this. This is new, I think. So true, Bun. So true. <laughs> so true. Women. I don't know if there are any men I think are, like, actually that, like, hot-sounding in this game. Probably just fucking what's-his-name, Walter. I think Walter's voice is, uh, Hamuna Hamuna Auga, but that's beside the point. <laughs> I'm overdoing it. I, I know I'm overdoing it. I'm fucking around. Um... I think it's pretty good. Rusty is also a doggy like 61. He is a funny dog, man. That's pretty cool. That's pretty based of him. The Needler from Halo? Let's go. <laughs> I'm sorry. I couldn't help myself. Napalm Bomb? That's a war crime. Yeah, true. Look at these big McLarge arms. They overburden my loadout, though. It's a shame. This is such a goofy set of legs. Archippus ADD? Damn, me too. The hell? How do I not have a single pair of tetrapod legs? I'm fixing that. Rick Dom legs. Full of Cybertron ass designs. So true, actually. Oh, this actually upgrades my current overall load weight to so probably put on something heavier. Uh. 
Alright, I still got like a, I think I got like one mission left in me. Or however long it's gonna take. If they get me more stuff to do in the arena, I'll probably do that and then I'll turn in for it. Now I'm kind of sleepy. Stop the top secret data breach. Okay. Ah, my favorite little tourist. You got it, boss. What's up? About my promise to take you up top. I need a little help cleaning up first. Okay. Fair enough. See, I'm certain someone smashed up all my defense hardware. Um. And now I've got rival dozers muscling in. <coughs> Sorry. It's the Junker Coyotes. We never did get on. Always okay. sniffing around, just waiting for a chance to bite. They're the Coyotes. This is one thing, but they're going after our development data too. Okay. We need to swap the hacking drones they sent before they make off with all my secrets. Yeah. Are those turrets? Pretty low of them. But at least give them credit for knowing where the value is. She's so funny, dude. Oh, I love Carla so much. Did I mentioned that this is all your fault. You can make up for it by keeping my secrets safe. You know what? Fair. Fair. Yeah, this is, I've, this is one of the t uh, two new missions I've done so far, not counting, well, also not, no, minimum not counting, also counting the uh, escort mission with the chopper. This is one of the new ones. Main system activating combat mode. Okay. Let's get rolling, Taurus. Destroy all the hacking drones those degenerate coyotes left here. I'm already in a deficit? Come on, game. Oh, I have to just shoot it. Straight out of the gates. Keep it up, tourist. Before I leave, let me see anything. Just around here. Up. Oh. The side of the system number one son is to remain at the lab. He's a, he's a reticent one, too. Tough beyond his years. And now every research problem of his mother and driven his father mad. He has every right to hate me. Perhaps our sister number two will be able to help. She's got a knack for assembling toys. Oh, but at least she can give him something to smile. Huh. Let's get back to the mount. Oh god. Oh, up here. I think. That's where I came in from. Are they two or are they the two? Oh wait, there's one behind me? Oh no, it's down, I think?
Oh, is it through there? Do I have to really kill this stupid thing? I guess so. Fuck, come on. Oh, I get through there. Other way forward? Let me restart this mission. I think a lot of things are just kind of breaking. <laughs> Lol. Um, Main system activating combat mode. What am I getting added for? Hold up. Let's get rolling, Taurus. Oh, okay. What is that? Is? Destroy all the hacking drones those degenerate coyotes left here. Let's be quick about this, Raven. Security breaches reached 10%. Firewall's going down fast. Must be about five drones to pull that off. Straight out of the gates. Keep it up, tourist. Oh, it's the other side, I think. Maybe. I need to do. No? How does this thing open? Should it from the other side, maybe? I don't know, actually. Unless I'm missing something? Oh, hello. I'm just blind. Jackass. Should be another one in here. Security breaches reached fifty percent. All right, one more. One left. You'd have to try to mess it up now. Now I have to. Hell yeah. So cool. Wait, the radar. Are there more of them? Yeah, I think things are potentially looking up. I hope they are. I'm tired enough as is. Oh, who did that? Iguazu? Hi. Oh my god. Hi. What's up, you giant loser? And here I thought I'd just make some extra scratch. Guess I can settle the score at the same time. But you don't know what. Coyotes got some help too. Sure thing, Iguazu. Ugh. 
I would like to lock on, please. Thank you. Trying to Oh god, my bad. Ah, uh, that is the wrong guy. I keep locking onto the wrong guy. Sorry, Iguazu. Reach starting the checkpoint. I'm, I'm getting. You guys want to be an important character in your story so so bad. Yeah, it's so funny. Like, dude. Got One or the other ones. You psycho or something? We're both in trouble here. Two repair kits remaining. Where'd they go? Hello. Guazu. I don't know why he has such a chip on his shoulder about you. Like, what's the deal with you, Guazu?
Yo, what up? Sure you would have, bud. I have, though. Looks like it's over. I'll have the crew check out those mechs. But, but like, I, I have one is the thing? Like, conclusively. Conclusively. Yeah, what's up with those guys? I never learned about what happened with those on the modern, on the main playthrough. I'm curious. What's up with those guys? The weird ball mechs that are very much semi-visible. There's like, I want to see what the lore is with some of these mechs. I'm gonna check out the little guide thingy. I need to get my hands arrest too. Oh, please, keep telling me it's another like Xbox Live salt post from Iguazu, please. stuff looks like a whole like little compendium of like lore bits and whatnot but I don't know where that is oh archives yeah There'll be something interesting in here, I guess not, but... Oh, there was this one thing from the guy. Where was it? Yeah, here it was. It was our only hope. No very new ruin that awaits both the Institute and Rukhan itself. Now I must restrain myself what follows. It just shows signs of a wave mutation. I was very much continue. This is number two is our only ring. Hope it pains me. I have no choice but lights. Lights get hurt my own student. Um... Something else he said. Like, oh, I didn't get it because I reset. I have to go get that back then. The next mission. Oh, this ends the chapter. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna night fought that right now. My hands are starting to give me trouble. I don't wanna. I love this game. It doesn't hurt my hands that much, but I haven't really stretched at all today. <sighs> ah, you know what? I might as well. Fuck all life. I'm in for the long haul. Here for a good time, not a long time, baby. Oh. As promised, Carla has agreed to serve as our guide. I love a good ass neck pop. It's the best. I'm not sure how safe it is to trust a dozer. But if we turn her down, we turn her knowledge down as well. Yeah, she's cool. Raven. Cinder. Carla's nickname. That's what the Rubiconians call survivors of the fires of Ibis. Oh, okay. But if the fires happened half a century ago... Well, it could just be some dozer inside joke. Oh, damn, really? Hotted old woman ahead? Let's go? <laughs> Let's go? Hotted old woman ahead. Awooga. But after this, I will take a break, and that'll be the end of the stream. Tomorrow will be the Jumble Gym at a usual three-hour length. Um, I'll probably end up working on themes now, so... This month's theme will be Fighty Game, and I'll try and augment that appropriately. I'll lead the way, just as promised. But after this, you owe me one. straight to the top of the grid, the outer shell. Sadly, that's beyond my territory. I mean, once you're out there, the PCA satellites see everything. A few of the stupider dozers took it as a challenge, went out to prove themselves. You can guess what happened. <laughs> mm. 
No, I can't. I can't put maximum impact in the rotation. It only goes up to, like... Ostensibly N64. Even that doesn't really work. So... Sadly, no. Get me the fuck out of here. I forgot how fucked up this mission is. Like, listen, if I could play Maximum Impact, I would. You're gonna get real bout instead. Hello, Gwen. Uh, stream's going alright. I started late. We're about to, like, pretty much end after this... After this, uh, mission. So, yeah, we're doing alright. Just running my mouth. No, it's fine. I'll be done in a little bit. But I, I, I do enjoy going back to this game. I love Armor Core. It's a good game. I got so lucky. Oh. Friday stream might not happen this week because I have family over, so I might be busy. That's what I like to see. Let's get the cargo launcher ready. There. Access the container. So yeah, if I end up not streaming, you know why. I'm a Ben 10 big chillin. Step inside. Wait. Enemy detected. I'm so dead, girl. I thought that was it for me for a minute, but that's it for me. Alright, let's try that again. Actually, no, I'll let this rock. I'm gonna try this with the, uh, the, the big boys. Zim and Ermin. Let's see how this handles this boss. Probably pretty handily if I had to assume. What second? <laughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> now if you could just step inside. Wait. Enemy detected.
second try, second try, let's go. Maybe before I want it to end, but I should be getting more arena data. So I'll probably take on like a couple of those if we're in the stream. Hi, Bobo. After this, I'm going to do the arena fights and I'll end the stream. Kind of short today. I started kind of late. Not like super, super late, but, you know, a couple minutes. I, I went at 529 instead of 525 because I, I literally was dicking around. I lost track of time. Uh, yes. It's called a sea spider, but yes, it is a pine cone. It had it coming. Tis the season after all. I bah humbug. Sick idea. No one's ever used it to launch themselves. It'll it'll never happen in real life. What are you talking? I'm learning more about dog girl. Oh, coupling. I see. Vaguely, I thought you just meant like dog girls being gay with each other. That's what you meant. But sure, I'll, I'll believe that. I'll buy that for a dollar, Captain. Ain't a uh, dog girl coupling that uh, the guy who wrote Fahrenheit uh, 451? Raven? No, it's a different guy. You. I'm thinking about Kipling. I'm thinking that's Ray Bradbury. Joke, joke canceled. Actually, put that shit away. I don't need it. Voices of the coral. Currents coursing across Rubicon. Walter was correct in his judgment. A uh, Kipling, Richard Kipling. That's a different writer. Different, 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 different writer. It's supposed to be a funny writer joke, and I, I, I messed it up. I'm sorry, Chad. I'm, I'm in shambles. I'm, I'm embarrassed. Don't look at me. Don't look at me. Ah! Anyway. I forget. Augmented human C4621 entering standard mode. One. Rudyard Kipling, wrong guy. Rudyard Kipling, that's what I'm thinking of. Old writer man. Oh, he wrote the Jungle Book. Okay, and Ricky Ticky Tabby and shit. Yeah. There you go. Good. I'm done tying up loose ends. This mistakey. Archibus found their own way in and are ready to deploy survey squads. Uh, and it looks like Balin. After you scooped out the place too, you know what's going to happen. Business as usual. <sighs> All right, let me do these last couple of work for us. arena missions. I'm gonna fuck off. Lol. New parts? Really? Let me see what those new parts are before I leave. Oh, Sieg missile launcher. Oh my god, that's kind of cool. Split missile launcher. I missed what I was looking at. Real side too. Oh, it's this, the container missile launcher. Oh, that's fun. 
New head? Look at this thing. Appetizer. Main dish. Salad. And dessert. What's this look like all together? I'm curious. Show me this thing. chunky thing look at this goofy chunky looking thing it's so chunky i kind of love it i'm not rocking it but i like it like oh my god look at look at these big stompies let me go back to like my old low out loadout with these legs it's gonna look so stupid Big stompies. <laughs> this thing's so goofy, dude. I kind of love it. These are the wrong arms I need, though. Where are my good arms? Yeah, yeah, don't worry. Take your time. I'm, I, I expect you to take your time. I don't I don't need you to do stuff, like, immediately ASAP. Take your time. Take your time, fam. I, I want you to make it as good as you could. So, I, I am... I am the most patient person on the face of the planet. Except when I need package. Then, then I am the most impatient person on the face of the earth. But... You know... Poe body's nerfic and all that shit. Yeah, hold on. I thought it would just be better than it, me just covering parts of the stream, but yeah, it is a little messy here. There we go. It doesn't even matter. We're about to be done with the stream anyway. Tomorrow we'll be losing an entirely separate play uh, game, so it'll be it'll be different. Anyways, um, you know the usual stuff applies here in my links. Uh, thanks to Jasmine for the sick raid. Um, anybody live right now? Looks like no one's really live right now. Um, yeah, well. yeah, it's over. I'm gonna. I was doing a short stream because I was a little tired. I got up at like hell early o'clock, so. I want to take some time to just rest and decompress. Um, you know, we'll have a longer stream tomorrow. Um, Friday, there might not be a stream. We will wait and see. We will see. We will see. But, um, you know, usual stuff applies. Uh, is anybody else? Let me see who's live real quick. Open up Twitch. Bobo, give me someone to, give me someone to raid, like, immediately. Right now. Who, 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 tell me who to raid. You don't have to though if you don't want to. I can just end the stream. It's literally, literally up to you. Akuya and Pankaro, like both. Yeah, I, I yeah, I, I think I follow Nekuro Akuya now, but uh, yeah, I haven't really interacted with them much. You know what? We'll, we'll we'll raid somebody next time. Sorry, I'm kind of just. You know what? Fine. We'll just we'll we'll, we'll, we'll raid Nakuya. Nakua? Yeah, I think that's the one. Anyways, hope you enjoyed tonight's stream. I'll be back, like I said, tomorrow with more of the jumbled gym. Uh, stay cool, everybody. Hope you enjoyed the stream. Goodbye. <laughs>